Y'all, we got us a King Daytona Hillcat Red Eye Mask. So if y'all don't know, these is a special edition, y'all. I think they only it's made like about like 200. They only made like 200 or 300 of these total. King Daytona badge right here. I turn her up to a pack. Best friend told her she better get back. Okay, 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 okay. Hey, I turn her up to a pack. A best friend told her she better get back. Say what you mean, we the rack. Cash on the road, better keep it a stack. There's only two seats in the back. Somebody can't come. I'm What's going on with the YouTube? It's your boy John. We back on another video, man. And in today's video, we drove all the way to Perfect Auto Collection, man, because we're gonna be looking at some cars, man. Your boy John trying to get rid of the RT so we can upgrade to a scat pack, hopefully. But I heard that this dealership got a crazy collection, man. So we're gonna pretty much just give y'all a walk around, show y'all everything. Yeah, we're gonna show y'all everything that they got and everything that we work with, man. <laughs> And we gonna make this a nice video for you, man. Uh, as y'all can see, look what's pulling out. All right, man, as y'all can see, the first whip that they got outside, man, a good Ram TRX, big 6.2, and they changed the wheels on it, so it don't got the OEM wheels on it. Dylan, come here, man, look at the TRX, man. Look at the big Rex. Man, Dylan, we'll, we'll be coming down today, man. So look, y'all, if y'all didn't know, he also looking for his first whip, too, but I'm gonna be looking for one mainly for referral, so. Like I said, I'm going to walk around, show y'all everything that they got, man. And I'm going to make this a nice video. Y'all see their little picture art and stuff that they got. And they look interesting. So Loki look nice, but like I said, I'm going to walk in. Show you everything that they got. And I'm going to make this a nice, interesting video for y'all, man. So as y'all can see, this one's sold, man. But gentlemen, come on. Look at the motherfucking road, boys, man. This, it's hot, too. Somebody, they just drove this. They just drove this. It's warm. So they just actually moved this or drove this, y'all. But it got peanut butter seats on the inside, man. All right, man. So as y'all can see, this is like a brown um, drop top Benz. It's a flat, <clears throat> flat bottom steering wheel. S550, y'all. That's the coupe version, I'm guessing. Hey, right, man. So as y'all can see, they uh, this one got to get a paint correction. They uh, got all the imperfections on the whip mark. But as y'all can see, man, look at this motherfucking steering wheel, y'all. And with the peanut butter guts, they did this MA so crazy. This motherfucker is nice. Only thing is, I probably just want to get this color. I would probably go with like a dark gray or black. Probably white, man. You feel me? Y'all, this is the soul side. But look, this is a white matte material on this range. Good range. Um, We got us a good S550. I believe that's S550. Is that a look what this is? Good taking S. You feel me? Good sting, Ray Jalen. This is the whip I'll be driving. Somebody bought this. It's some of their business name, too. They got the special plate. Good V8 by Turbo Benz, the old school version. This. Then we got this nice Lambo, man. This Lambo is so crazy, bro. I'm not going to lie to y'all. I know it's locked. I can see the alarm right here blinking, so I know that that's locked, man. I need a pill to sleep. Yeah. I got a drink just to smoke, smoke just to drink. Yeah. I saw dirty. Yeah. Cold the AMG GTS, man. Let me know what y'all think of this, man. Um... That's white with the peanut butter guts, man. You see me? It's a little dirty right now. This got to get cleaned up. Go around, John. Go around. Go around, bitch. Ooh. Damn. Damn. This bitch a rocket ship, low-key, y'all. What the fuck? Like, you sit down, down... Look at their gauges and their buttons and their power switches and shit, man. Like, let me know what y'all think, man. Would y'all ever see me in one of I these? Cars that you have in these type of one, like this oh, one. where the, where the feel like that? Yeah. What you think about this? This is how you control your screen and shit. It's like touch screen. All right, man. That's all I can see, though. Good Beamer. This look like an i7. This is the electric one for sure. You feel me? Peanut butter guts. Ugh, that shifter in the middle, ugly. Look at the middle. Look in the back seat. Oh, yeah, you control your seats right there in the middle. You see on the middle on the side? Look, that's how you control your seats. Oh, this bitch probably classy, y'all. I ain't gonna fake. Panoramic on the top. Come on, read this way. Good uh, C8, man. Going, I saw him. With the peanut butter inside, man. Let me know what y'all think, man. <clears throat> this one look fly. Good thing, Gray. Then these ones got like four. These got like 470. These like they scat vets, pretty much. But these still get up through, man. As y'all can't see. Then we got us a, a good double R, navy blue. This is probably the, one of the nicest ones that I've seen so far. 
white guts even though it's an older year y'all this one probably still look crazy just to the fact that what they had added to it you feel me like as all i can see like you feel me man come on now let me know man would y'all would y'all get y'all an amg or would y'all get y'all a rose voice double r you feel me <coughs> Um, good range truck. We ain't really paying attention to the range trucks because we got so much other shit better than that. But if, for the people that do like range trucks, do y'all like that? You feel me? Back to back Benzes, another MG S65, Lincoln truck, cool little fleet, man. This only the first half, y'all. When we go back upstairs, they got more stuff upstairs. I'm just showing y'all what they got on this floor because I didn't show y'all that side yet. But, um, this motherfucker got the tow hook on the front. These be looking hard. I like the little tow hooks on the front. Um, Z06, man. This they this they Hillcat version of it. This one got 650 horsepower, John. Yeah, man. Got the nice little spoiler on the back. I'm at Wicker Bill. That's all I can see. Quad tips. So you know this motherfucker loud, John. And they got this um, old school Rari up here, man. So they got this Rari up here. It's a little dirty, y'all, but it's still a Rari, man. So let me know what y'all think of this. Where y'all get this, man? I probably would too because it's murdered out. All they got to do is make the tent a little darker, but I will get this motherfucker. Even though we got the ugly back end, y'all, it's still a Ferrari. You, oh, you fuck with that back end? You think it's cool? Even though it's a Ferrari, y'all, like I said, I'm taking it. You feel me? It's a Ferrari. Like, I'm, I don't know nobody who would deny Ferrari that have in a collection, man. Like, come on now. I can't see, man. It's the big Mercedes truck. I don't know which one this is, y'all. I know it's a Maybach truck, but this the one that squat up and down, y'all. So that's the one that bounce up and down with the crazy hydraulics on it, man. Let me know what the... Actually, let me go back here and tell y'all what the name of this one is. Uh, Jenna, come to the back. Oh, my God. What the fuck? You be in this bitch relaxing. <laughs> that's the GLS 600 Maybach truck, y'all. So if y'all ever wanted this classy, fly, comfortable pillow head rest type shit, man. This the one to try to get. <laughs> I don't like the interior color choice that they picked on it. They could have chose a different color on the interior seat for the seats and shit, but I would still get it, man. You feel me? It's an orange McLaren, man. Orange calipers with the orange stitching, man. Carbon fibers, uh, side, mar side mirrors, flat bottom steering wheel, um, factory little wing on the back, man. Carbon fiber. Yeah, man, that's motherfucking nice. I ain't gonna lie. It's the older year, but it's a McLaren, so. I still get this look carbon fiber on the side. Carbon fiber. Drop top man. Yeah, like got the orange stitch and I like the orange stitch and I go with the, the color of the car man, like I said. And man, so we got us a yellow Lambo. I think that's a Venador. Let me know which one it is or a hurricane. Cause they got the doors like uh that just pull out. It don't got the uh butterfly doors, but it got yellow stitching in it, Alcantara, forged carbon on the inside. Um it got the Epoxy glass to show your engine bay. Forest carbon wing. Ugh. So we got us a good GT3, man. Let me know, man. Like I said, this motherfucker is crazy. I'm starting to fuck with GT3s a little more. This one got an Alcatara steering wheel. Automatic rear stitching. Rear stitching on the door panels. You got a nice little wing on the back. This is not the RS, but this is still crazy, y'all. The RS is right here on the side. So let me know. Look, yeah, man. So we got us a dark gray GT3. Then on the side, we got us a GT3 RS, man, in white. Um, this one got the bucket seats. Look at the back. You can see from the back. This one got the racing bucket seats, man. Um, yeah, it got the bucket seats, carbon fiber on the inside, y'all. Um, this one not too crazy. It's just this, this one low-key playing, y'all. But it's still a GT3 RS. Um, it got the yellow stripe on the middle of the steering wheel. You come to the side, this look like another one of the Ferraris that we just seen down there. This one got the peanut butter inside, see so, yep. Flat bottom steering wheel, yeah. This, the, oh yeah, and look at how, look how you can sit back there. Loki look comfortable back there too, if you know what I'm trying to say. Yeah, man. No, that's a Ferrari. No, it's Ferrari Coupe. Ferrari Coupe, hatchback. No, it's a Ferrari hatchback, it's my bad, my bad. It's a Ferrari hatchback. It's called a GTC. Let's so T. That's the first time I ever heard that damn name off for four. Man, so let's all can't see. We got some dark purple McLaren, man. Look at the paint as all can't see. We go up close to look uh, purple, but on camera, it's picking up black vibes. I like this color, y'all. Just to the fact that it's picking up black vibes because I like the darker side color. Um, it got carbon fiber, carbon fiber. 
nice Alcantara steering wheel. It got leather seats. I don't fuck with the leather seats. I wish I had the Alcantara seats, but that's cool. But it's still a McLaren. So I'm taking this one. This might be the one I'm going to go to out of all the McLarens that we've seen here, y'all. I like this color. I ain't going to fake with the yellow calipers. Yeah. Jalen, this might be the one I'm picking out of the McLaren side compared to that orange one that you said you're taking. I'm picking this. That's another GT3, man. That's not an RS. Just just the basic uh, GT3 carbon fiber, carbon fiber bucket seats. Ooh, this got a blue seat belt, y'all, and a blue stitching. This one looking not bad, y'all. Look, Johnny, you see the blue seat belt? This looking hard. Blue seat belt, okay. blue stitching. Um, factory wing going to back y'all. Let me know what y'all think, man. That's not bad. Um, carbon fiber, like I said. Oh, I didn't peep the top. It's carbon fiber too, y'all. So the top of the hood is carbon fiber. It looked black though, but yeah, carbon fiber on the top. Come to the side. We got us a double R again. Another double R with the white seats. Um, this one got the drop top too, y'all. Side doors like right here. It got the wooden accents, y'all. I wouldn't get this one because I don't like the wooden accents in mine. So I ain't gonna lie. This look like an old car. Oh, that's real wood. You know, feel it. Feel it. It's like real wood and a double R. Okay, okay. The uh the details, y'all, but that's that's not some of the details that I would like in my car. That's a little too old school. It's another double R. This one got the thing tucked down, y'all, unfortunately. Um, this one got better woods than the last one, too. And this one got black seats. Um, this one definitely looked way different than the other one, too. They all look different than the last ones, y'all. So keep that in mind. You feel me? Alright, man. Now we got us a matte black Ferrari, man. That's crazy. I don't, if this factory, this crazy, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. It might be wrapped though, but um, they got bucket seats with Alcatara on the inside, flat bottom steering wheel. Um, I can't tell y'all if it's a V10 or 12. I don't know. Y'all gotta let me know down in the comments though. But yeah, man, nice Ferrari though. It's nice and clean, nice and low. I'll for sure take this one. Matte black. Look crazy, man. All you need is dip them bleach. I'm praying for my niggas headed down to Tennessee. I'm driving to a little bit. Man, so we got some matte black AMG truck. Maybach truck, I apologize. Rear guts, man. This motherfucker nice. This is what we just seen, John. Literally just seen this. We literally just seen this in traffic on the way here, y'all. We just seen one of these in traffic on the way here, man. Yeah. Nice matte black. Y'all, we got us a King Daytona Hillcat Red Eye, man. So if y'all don't know, these is a special edition, y'all. I think they only it's made like about like 200. They only made like 200 or 300 of these total, John. Worldwide. That's it. So, this is the last call edition, y'all. If you pop the hood, it had a last call plaque. Gloss black side mirrors. King Daytona badge right here. Man, so we got a white Bentley. This ain't a double R. This a Bentley. Um, white inside. It's Loki cream. They tried to make a white. It look like, though, 200 on the dash, though, John. Look, 200 on a dash. So this motherfucker Loki got some horsepower on it, y'all. It might have got at least like 400, 500. These Loki uh be fast, y'all, but they just don't never tell y'all the power on them if y'all really pay attention to these type of cars, man. Um, on the side we got us another range truck. We got us another M4, y'all. This M4 look nice. This one look better than the other one with the seats that they got, with the white seats. This one don't got that flat bottom uh glow up steering wheel though. This one don't got the steering wheel in it, y'all. So. <clears throat> Yeah, it got us a good, cool M4 quad tips on the back, man. Carbon fiber on the top, factory carbon fiber. On the side, we got us another GLS truck. This one got the same guts like the last one. So I ain't gonna show y'all this one. So we got us a Bentley truck with the red guts, man. Let me show y'all this. Red guts, man. It's a first edition on the inside. Y'all see that first edition? So this one got to be special edition or something like that, man. You feel me? I don't know. Yeah, it got to be something. You feel me? Something special to it, y'all. It's not basic because, as y'all can't see, it's a first edition in it. Get them three comp. No. M3 comp, man. This motherfucker so nice. Oh, my gosh, y'all. Carbon fiber up on the top. It got the normal steering wheel, y'all. I will swap it out with the Alcatara one. White and uh, gray seats. White wheels, man. This motherfucker nice. I'm not gonna fake it to y'all. That is a Selby Super Snake. I didn't even put this as a Super Snake, y'all. So, as y'all can see, man, good 600, 700 horsepower. I think they got like 780, actually, y'all. Automatic, too, y'all. This one, not uh, manual, too. 
Let me know if y'all are drive this, man. Good Shelby. I'm not a Ford dude, but just to the fact that it's a Shelby, I would drive it just because I know I got a little bit more power than the normal shit that they be making. A good non little turbo SUR. Let me know what y'all think, man. It got the white, uh, white tail lights in the back instead of the red ones. Carbon fiber, uh, fenders on the side. Black leather seats. This one, like, crazy like the other ones that we're seeing over there, but that's because those GT3 RSs. But we got another uh, navy blue double R. Blue stitching on the seats, man. This one look nice. I ain't gonna lie. This one look nice. I ain't gonna fake it to you, man. <laughs> um, Let me know all the, all the double R's. What was your favorite one y'all seen? Dylan, what was your favorite? Pick your favorite double R. Show me right now. Follow. Pick your, no, your double R. Go to double R, man. Um, follow me. Yeah, like, I gotta follow you, too. Your favorite double R, man. You said you about to show us your... <laughs> oh yeah man I didn't show y'all this front row but I'm gonna show y'all as I'm walking past real quick so my black Rory gloss black Rory they both the hatchbacks both got peanut butter seats hmm that's fine so he said he coming this one man y'all got the white extension seats you feel me black with the white stitching carbon fiber console in the middle Okay, okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> All right, man. Let me show these last couple though, man. We got a stuff. White Matt uh MG. Good inside flat bottom steering wheel, man. Um, nice double R. This ain't a double R, this a uh Mayback. back. I apologize, y'all. Nice Mayback. back. <clears throat> Pull up headrest, cream inside. It look real comfortable on the inside, y'all. That's how you would want to probably take them road trips, man. So, I would probably grab one of these, grab one of these. Once I get financially stable to own one of them, once I get the money to, you feel me? But look at the details, man. Um, I hope I was talking good enough to y'all. But I'm low-key a little bit disappointed that we can't sit on the inside, though, too, y'all. Because sitting on the inside would have made it a little bit more better to, to look at some of this stuff. But that's fine, man. Um... All right, man, that's up, boys. Can't see. We are up in the AMG and Mercedes dealership. You feel me? Let me show them this. Come on, we in this. Go on outside. Go on outside. Yo, as I can't see, this one got the carbon fiber door panels with the red stitching. With the red. <clears throat> Let me know what y'all... Well, this one a little tight to get in, y'all. Hold on. All right, man. So, we're leaving the dealership, man. Um, I hope y'all boys enjoy it. Make sure y'all boys like, comment, share, subscribe. I hope it was decent. Uh, good for y'all, like I said. I wish I was able to get inside some of these whips, but due to how, how much they cost, they, I see how they try to keep them a little bit clean and detailed and tidy by keeping people from getting on the inside so i understand that but it's all right but we're gonna end the video off right here man i hope y'all boys enjoy it man peace look at my racks solid i see the grass getting long snakes i'm gonna mow it i'm gonna blow like brown racks on me i'm sorry talk here top of the morning i'm in the car got motion Baby, okay, fall.